Let me get my coffee. I'm leaving the country. I am very excited about it. Ryan and I haven't taken a trip together in a couple of years and we really need it. I'm very excited to get some quality time <laughs> in the warmth, especially. I just thought I would take you through the day with me for all of my leaving the country prep, particularly for my plants. Where do I wanna start though is the question. Honestly, I don't even know if this is gonna work. <laughs> One of my things I really enjoy about plants is experimenting and trying new things to see if they'll work really well. So, you know, I'm gonna do a little experiment while I'm gone. I have this cotton rope. Cut the rope. These are the worst scissors. I need to buy new scissors, but it's like raveled into three pieces. So I'm just unraveling them, separating them, I guess. And I'm gonna put a bobby pin through the center like this. <laughs> Big paradise to put up a parking lot. Big old Helen is in the hot spot. Don't it always seem to go that you don't know what you got till it's gone? Ba ba ba. Can you tell me? Do I end up? Do I end up happy. Close your eyes. <laughs> Gonna wish we never met on the day I leave. Okay, so here's the plan. Put these into the drainage holes of some of my more thirsty plants and then set them on cookie, cookie cooling sheets, racks, with these hanging underneath so I can put some water in the bathtub. This will wick moisture up into the pot, hopefully. Okay, my trip is in 10 days, so I don't know if this is like really necessary, but I do just have some very thirsty plants. So I thought we would try this. Like I said, I like to experiment. So we're gonna try this with a bunch of plants. So I'm just gonna put the bobby pin up the bottom like that. Oh, dang, the string's a little bit thick, but, oh no, wait, that'll work. Put the strings, if I, I'm so, I drink too many coffees. <laughs> yeah, but then it'll wick it. Well. Maybe more upright plants would be better, not so much hanging, because I don't want them to hang in the water, but I mean, we'll see. We'll see, I'm just gonna roll with it. Okay. My plants and moss, I'm not so much worried about, especially large ones like this, just in the bathtub with that little bit of water. I don't know, okay, it's just a test. <laughs> I don't know if it's gonna work. Okay, so I've added water into the bathtub and since we're here, I'm gonna pack like my little toiletry bag. <sighs> okay. I have this little toiletry bag. It's like the perfect size to fit everything. I keep it very simple. I have these reusable containers that I put my face wash in this one, conditioner in this one, shampoo, my moisturizer. Where is it? I don't even know if this is like 
acceptable, but I just mix. So I use like three serums. I use niacinamide, the Ordinary Buffet Peach and Lily Glass Skin. This is all three of those together. Oh, I just got my Harry's in the mail. So of course I'm gonna take it with me because these razors are the bomb. So I'm very thankful to Harry's for like not only the super close shave, but also for sponsoring this video. Let me tell you a little bit about them. You know what, I'm gonna show you. Let's shave the old stems. <laughs> I'm not gonna get in the actual shower. Oh yeah, baby. Look at that. In my youths, I used to really like lay on the shaving cream thick. I've learned now in my old age that that's not necessary. The blade flexes really nicely. There's no snagging. With my coarse ass hair, it gets caught in razors I've used in the past, but not Harry's. Should I bring you in a little closer? Probably. Something I thought was really cool is that the Harry blades are actually made in Germany in a factory where they've been making blades for a hundred years. So like, you know that they know their shit there, you know? And not only that, they don't have a pink tax. They charge what they have to charge, nothing more. Whereas a lot of other brands, you know, are charging more just because they can, because they know they can get away with it. Harry's, Harry's isn't gonna allow that. It makes me feel like a dolphin. I feel like a dolphin. But I'm gonna go put back on my pants because where is this going? <laughs> They are offering you their trial set for just $5. Normally it's $13, still very affordable, but like why not take advantage of that $5 offer? And you can do that by clicking my link. They gave me a link, let me find it. Harrys.com slash Harley G. There's something about the weight of this I love. Anyway, you know what? I'm gonna stop blabbering on about it. It's awesome, it's awesome. People snorkeling on my trip might confuse me with a dolphin. Let's move on. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna water my plants. For, to water this upright lemon lime, it takes like three of these. Gosh, it's so beautiful. I've been gathering plants on my counter over here to take down to my grow tent. So like my carnivorous plant bog I made will be going down there just so I don't have to worry about it. <laughs> as well as some of my aquatic plants and just ones that dry out very, very easily or finicky ones, you know, they're going in the grow tent. I moved this down here because I have a light that I have to turn on every day for it that is not on a timer and I don't want my sister to have to deal with that. So I'm just moving it here so that it can get guaranteed sunlight from the grow lights that are on a timer every single day. This Hoya Matilde I brought down because like my kids are very attracted to it. And again, I didn't want my sister to have to worry about like other little things like this. And my last little tray of plants. Oh, actually while we're down here, I, glad I remembered. I'm sending out my Patreon member gifts today. It's kind of a combined last month and this month gift. It's a small little Hoya plant with a planter I made. Um, so I got to pick out some plants to send. 13. Here they are. I'm gonna clean the diatomaceous earth off. The second part of the gift are these little planters I made. I've been working on for so long, they took forever. Oh no. I've just been storing them in the oven ever since I baked them to save on counter space. <laughs> Oh, 
This is just one example, but there's a lot of them. They're all kind of different. I'm just gonna send them at random. I'm just gonna box them all up at once and then label them so that it's totally randomized. But I am gonna match plants to planters that I think like look the cutest together. Okay, there we go, they're sorted. buddy yeah buddy my hand is dead okay let's package Talk in my pockets, just no weed. You guys, look what we just found just out in the wild.